Did you ever notice that Susan and Mary have more trophies than me? What? Me? No. What trophy case? Tell the truth. Yeah, I noticed. It's a bit pathetic, but hey, you won a trophy! No, we didn't. We won it. And we ran out of room in our trophy case. So we need to use Johnny's. Hey, that's not fair. Dad built that trophy cabinet for me. Then try winning a trophy for once in your life, little brother. Whoa, that is harsh even for you. You have to want it, Johnny. You have to want winning more than anything. You just might not have the killer instinct like we do. Yeah, well, you know what? I do. I do have the killer thing, and I will win a trophy. So ha! Ha ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Doggy helped Johnny win trophy to prove Johnny not a loser. Johnny, not winning trophies doesn't make you a loser. Of course, it doesn't make you a winner either, but you are not a loser. Then what am I? Well, it's true you haven't won anything, but you have to enter a contest to win or lose, and you never enter contests, so basically you're... nothing. Did that help? No. And I'm gonna put something in that trophy case if it's the last thing I do! Oopsie, I stormed off too quickly. So how do I win a trophy? Oh, there's a junior golf tournament this weekend and they give out huge trophies. Are you any good at golf? Let's get dad's clubs and find out. I'm not good at golf. Well, $200 should take care of that window in your future emergency room visit, right? <laughs> No more golf! Why? Because I do not have a million dollars to pay for your troublemaking! Okay, what's Johnny win a trophy plan B? The Junior Rodeo Championships are in town this week. Are you sure you can ride a bull? That's why we're practicing. Uh, right. Now, where did you get the bull? Is it really important? Now open that gate and let's ride! <laughs> is having a really bad day. And here's 600 more dollars to cover your insurance deductible. Johnny, look in my wallet and tell me, do you see a million dollars? Uh, nope. Then no more bull riding! Wait, why are you bull riding? I'm trying to win a trophy. I can't take Susan and Mary winning all the time. Johnny need big shiny thing in cabinet. Son, you don't need a trophy to prove you're a winner. I mean, I never won a trophy and look at me. You're gonna win a trophy by watching TV? No, I'm gonna find out how to win a trophy by watching TV. You know how sometimes we'll be in the middle of something and that dude on the TV will give us an idea? Johnny, that is ridiculous. So you wanna win a huge trophy? Hmm? And now I stand corrected. Hank Anchorman here with eccentric billionaire Branson Ridgeway, who is kicking off the Pork Belly River Jump Cup. I've placed a huge trophy and an oversized check for one million dollars on the other side of the Pork Belly River. All you have to do to get it is jump the river in an unmotorized tricycle. That sounds cool. No, it doesn't. It's my goal to expand the possibility of a fuelless future. Because if mankind can jump a large river on a tricycle, there's nothing we can't do. You seriously believe that? I believe that it's the job of an eccentric billionaire to eccentrically push Eccentricity. What does eccentric mean? Rich, weird, and cuckoo, and you are not jumping the Pork Belly River on a tricycle. No way! Johnny, do you want to test a super air compressed super trike? No way! I'll test your super trike and then you'll use it to jump the river and get that big fat trophy! Well, you can forget it! I'm getting that trophy! I'm jumping the river! Who's got the killer instinct now? Just so you know, I will not help an 11-year-old boy crash into a river. It's just so you know, blah, 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 I'm jumping the river! Pedal? Seriously, you're gonna pedal over the river? No, I'm gonna pedal over the pool to test my speed and trajectory. I will win that trophy. It's just a trophy. It's not even real gold. Say hello to the Air Cannon Supersonic Super Trike. Or, as I like to call it, the trophy winner. That is so lame. Okay, who am I kidding? That is awesome! Every student at the university has entered the Pork Belly River Jump Cup. But we are going to win it. Now, check out the sound of 8,000 pounds of air pressure blasting me on it. Run. She's really gonna ride it? You're not the only crazy test driver around here, Johnny. Here we go! Ah! 
I'm sure this will cover the damage for the truck. <laughs> Who needs to retire at 65 anymore, right? <laughs> what did I say before? Oh yeah, I do not have a million dollars! You are all grounded! But Dad! No butts! In your rooms, no! But if we jump the Pork Belly River on a trike, I'll win a big shiny trophy and one million dollars. Yeah, I don't care! Wait, did you say a million dollars? Individually, we can't make that jump. But with the girl's invention, Johnny's reckless abandon, and my approval, together we can make that jump and win that money! No, I have to win it myself. Johnny, every great champion has a winning team behind them. Nobody does it themselves. They're right. Whether it's a race car championship or the World Series, it's all about teamwork. One million dollars. One million! But I get to keep the big shiny trophy. I get the money. And we get the satisfaction of winning. Let's go to the river! Time out. Let's just take a minute, one minute, Johnny, to think about what's really important and... Johnny wants shiny trophy! It's just metal. What's really important is staying alive! Don't sweat it. It's gonna be a piece of cake. was awesome! Everyone from school is here. That's Emily Smartpuff from Advanced Biochemistry. And that is one trophy you will not get, Susan and Mary Tess. <laughs> okay, now your dad is totally going to put a stop to this. Oh, I can see the big check from here. It is huge! And there's also a huge headwind. We're gonna have to boost the air pressure to 10,000 pounds. We're such geniuses. But not as genius as me, tiny classmates and little bro. Cha. Tim Burnout? Don't even think about it, Jack. That trophy is mine. <laughs> this trophy will not be yours, but mine. Thanks to my totally awesome sonic trike. What? <laughs> It's the best one yet! You're really just a rich nut who likes to watch people crash in a river, huh? Uh, <clears throat> no, um, I'm an eccentric who just wants to push human boundaries to show that mankind is boundless. Really? The cameras are off. This isn't on the record. Can't you see that splash? <laughs> Nelly! Next, Next up, up, Johnny, Johnny Tass. Okay, what do you say we boost to one million pounds of pressure? Sounds good to me. <laughs> Remember, John, it doesn't matter how you get over the river. You just have to get over. I'm so proud of you, million dollars. I mean, son. I can't let you do this. You mean you can't stop me from doing this? A million dollars? One million? Okay, listen up! You have all lost your minds! Johnny's risking his life for a dumb gold cup that isn't even gold, and his ultra-competitive sisters have clearly become obsessive about winning, which is not part of the scientific method. And you, Dad! You would let your own son jump a river for money! Did Dookie just talk? Because you're so crazy with money and winning, you're seeing dogs talk! Now close your eyes, shake your head, and come to your senses! Close your eyes and shake your head! We're going home, kids. I've just realized in a totally freaky hallucination that this jump and that money is not worth it. So did we. No! Johnny won shiny trophy! And we also realized that all the trophies we've won are all because you tested them, Johnny. So technically, you deserve half of them. Okay, I'm cool. Now, what do you say we go home and move some of those big trophies into your cabinet? I love you all. <laughs> And I'll shut down this rocket trike before it explodes. Yeah, we definitely went too heavy on the air pressure. Yeah! He made it! Nice job, buddy. A big, shiny trophy in my cabinet that the whole family can enjoy. Yeah. And thanks for the million dollars, boy. Now Johnny can go to college and Mom and I can retire at 65 again. The only thing I can't figure out is what happened to the Sonic trike. It should have returned to Earth by now. <gasps> huh? What 
are the odds? Here, this should cover the cost of a new house. <laughs> uh, <laughs>